morning, Idaho 515 now on your Monday morning and what a picturesque weekend as far as our weather went. Could it have been any more beautiful out there with the crystal clear blue skies that we were seeing just a few puffy clouds that were passing through, but for the most part, a drier air mass that's been working its way through all weekend. It's been bringing us more seasonable temperatures and as I mentioned at the top of the hour, normal for this time of year is 82 degrees and yesterday we were very, very close to that. 83 as well in Twin Falls and heading up to the mountain area is a little bit cooler, so at least for most of the day, it's going to feel a little bit chilly, but topping out at 72, 75, that is pretty nice, especially in those higher elevations. Do pay attention to the very cool mornings up in those mountain areas, though. 35 in Stanley right now, 48 in McCall. So heading out to the bus stop, you're going to really notice that fall is starting to set in, at least with our temperatures. 58 in Boise right now, 60 degrees in the Twin Falls area. And as I mentioned as well, about 15 minutes ago, it is so clear out side that you can see every star in the sky. It's absolutely gorgeous. The low pressure center that brought us those storms last week is well to our northeast and all of that monsoonal moisture staying well to the southeast of us while we just get high pressure setting back into the west. And what that means is drier air. It's also going to bump up our temperatures. So if you've been feeling maybe a little melancholy that fall is here and summer seems to be gone, then don't worry because look how high this jet stream goes by midweek. We're seeing those temperatures that are well above average once again. So forecast for today in the Treasure Valley, mid 80s once again, maybe one or two degrees warmer than what we saw yesterday, but all in all just a gorgeous afternoon with clear skies, maybe a light breeze out of the northwest. It's just going to feel very refreshing out there. Same story for the Magic Valley as well, hovering right around the 80 degree mark, Burley making it up to those mid 70s, so maybe a little bit cool for most of the day. You head up to the mountain locations and at least for Riggins, Council, Idaho City, we're in the 80s, but you do see those mid 70s in the Long Valley. So again, pretty chilly for most of the day until about midday. You're going to start to feel like it's just perfectly temperatured out there. Now we take a look at my on your side extended forecast, a beautiful start to the work week, and then things start to really warm up as that jet stream jets to the north. We see 89 for a high on Wednesday and notice here no 90 degree temperatures until we make the end of the weekend. That's also when we get some more cloud cover sneaking back into the picture and from Wednesday until the weekend. That's when we see our next best chance for some thunderstorms possible.